Under 90 seconds, I'm gonna give you guys the breakdown and the skinny of what you need to do to fix your cortisol and thyroid struggles that are slowing down or just flat out stopping your GLP-1 weight loss journey. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Dr. Jones DC, a weight loss expert. So number one, cortisol. This is your stress hormone, fight or flight. And stress, remember, can be happening from any sort of either physical stress, it could be literally be a sickness to your body, it could be an intolerance to food that you continue to be eating, it could be a mold in the house. A lot of physical stressors can raise your cortisol, as well as mental and emotional stressors around the house, those conversations that you've been pushing off, that conversation with your boss that you need to have. Elevated cortisol will cause elevated blood sugar, and elevated blood sugar will drive your insulin resistance. Tackle your stressful things, quit pushing them off, reorganize them, make them less stressful. Even if you just make them a little bit less stressful, your body will thank you later. Number two, thyroid. If you have these symptoms, like half or more tiredness, brain fog, constipation, feeling cold, achy body, hair loss, brittle skin and nails, feeling just overall achy and not well, this is likely thyroid. Even if your doctor told you your thyroid's fine, they're doing a very incomplete test. TSH does not tell you the big picture. You need a comprehensive test, free T3, free T4, and reverse T3, and you need to get it worked with by a functional doctor who understands thyroid management. Implement these two strategies and you will do wonders when it comes to optimizing your GLP-1 weight loss. And if you guys want a comprehensive free guide that goes over not just two, but four reasons why your weight loss is slowed down or just hasn't started at all, comment the word slow and we'll send you that free guide.